All right, all right. My hair's a mess, but what's up? So today is, I mean, honestly, the first full day of this whole uh, doing this thing. And uh, we're going to try something new because there's going to be a whole lot of trying new things. And that new thing is using a built-in mic on the camera. I have no idea what this is going to sound like, so you're going to experience it with me. And what we're going to do today is go out to the shop and I'm going to paint the project that is started. You know, the, the wood stuff I've been working on. So, let's go do that. Yeah, you okay with that? Yeah, not bad. I do have a wide angle for this, but I don't think I'll need it out there. Got some agua. It's dehydrated. So what I am going to do is I'm going to put some socks and shoes on. I'm going to go get the heater started in the shop. And then we're going to enjoy nature for a little bit. It's cold as hell. I'm sure. Okay. Come with me. So, my paint's gone. I don't know where my paint is. Oh, it's so cold. Oh, it's not bad in the sun, though. You know what? We had an electrician over today, so it's probably already warm in here. And the lights on. It's kind of warm. Heat is on. And uh, my paint's not out here. So, I'd really like to just meditate out here, but it's so cold. I might just have to do it in the sunroom for a little bit. Found the clear. This is, this is what we needed. Okay. I'm going to sit and enjoy. The glory that's Mother Nature. hard to do a whole lot of that when uh, it's freezing out. This is kind of vloggy. I know. But I'm testing things out. So, got a whole bunch of new equipment, a whole bunch of other things, and uh, I need to know what I'm working with. And you're just gonna have to come along with me. Okay. So this, oh, this will be, for the most part, where Tatanka in the shop is going to happen. Um, in the shop. What I'm going to have to do is clear off all this dust up there. Because uh, we've still been working. And all I'm doing is throwing some clear on these. So, And I'm going to try to get you a good angle, but uh, I suppose I make no promises. Just because now... Everything's been moved around and stuff. And it's a bit of a mess. So, hey, that's pretty good. We're going to go right about there. As you can probably see, the shop is a bit of a work in progress. But uh, we just got 220 installed out here, which is super dope because I have compressors that are 220. So, I kind of have to have that. Yes, you know. I guess it's not very level, but you know what? It's a vlog. We're gonna so just gonna get this dust off here. It's gonna get loud.
There we go. So, just throwing some clear on these. This is just to try to, uh, I don't know, make the finish a little stronger. These are the crossbars for the bed frame that we're building for me. <clears throat> and after that, got to paint these feet and these cross, these support bars and those things. There's a little bit more to do with this project. So, I'm just going to clear these up and, uh, yeah, that's it. There we go. That's one can down. Glad I got two. And some of you might be wondering, Aaron, why the hell are you showing us this? Well, what I tend to do with this channel is show that uh, anybody can do these things. I'm nothing special. You know, I, I painted for Carvana uh, when I was in North Carolina, but that doesn't mean anything. And society has come to this weird conclusion that when something's broken, just toss it out and replace it. Whether that's things or people or relationships, even like anything like that. And I intend to show that even relatively new things, you know, like technology-wise and, 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 and things can be fixed, can be repaired, can be improved uh, by people at home. So, my wife and I broke our bed. It's, uh, we got it in 2018, so it's a couple years old, but uh, I don't feel like it should have broken so soon. I uh, did go through two moves in the process, so that may have weakened some things, but still. And the bed frame's made out of metal, so that's kind of the biggest confusion, really. And uh, so we're building a bed frame to slide into the nice surround of the bed, and the bed just so happens to be black. So this is why I'm making things black. Uh, this gloss isn't super shiny, it's like a semi-gloss, I kind of like it. And uh, it says high gloss on the can, but it's really not on wood, so that's good. But uh, the rest is just going to be like a matte, but straight up matte black, which is the paint that's on there. So anything that happens, whether it be something breaking or uh, an issue with a person or yourself or a family member or, you know, your relationship that... Uh, is a little troublesome. 
it's not always about just tossing it out, starting over with something new because it's exciting or maybe your relationship's been going on for a while and it's kind of lost its luster. So you're just like, well, a lot of people will cheat or leave. And the thing with, uh, you know, long lasting relationships is there's a lot of growth. There's a lot of healing and eventually it can come to a situation where uh, you kind of forget why you're together. And <clears throat> not to get too personal, but there are some things going on with, with uh, my relationship as well. And uh, I've come to the realization that I let life take over me. And uh, I wasn't present in the moment. And that's what's really important, is remembering to be present. And uh, that changes everything. So, I'm digressing a little bit here, but really what I'm getting at is, I think it's important for people to remember that uh, you can fix things, and it's good to do so. My battery's about to die, so we're going to have a little bit of a cut. I'm going to deal with that. And we're back, baby. So I'm just going to finish up these last few with this clear. I'll give you a little show of what it looks like. And we'll go from there. Yeah, buddy, let's take a look at them while they're wet. Yeah, there's a couple of them that I did another coat on. Just try to fill in some of the wood a little bit. But uh, yeah, this is going to turn out great. I'm happy with this, so uh, yeah. I'm just going to set you down here, and uh, we're basically done in here now, so I'm going to take this with me, I don't want to leave this out here in the cold, I'm going to take my mask off and try to get out of here pretty quick, so I don't choke on these fumes. That's some strong stuff. <coughs> Don't do that. So, yeah. I might come out. Actually, I'm not even going to say I might because I won't. I'm not going to come out. Those are done. They're going to stay how they are. And that's how it is. So, uh, Hope you enjoyed the first Aaron blog, vlog thing. Don't know how many more there's going to be. Um, there are series being planned and created. And uh, honestly, I hope the audio from this, the built-in mic, wasn't poopy. Got to know where I'm at with my hardware. Hey, yeah. Uh, Stay hydrated. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna refresh my water. 
I'm going to go downstairs and I'm actually going to edit this. I don't know when it's going up, but I'm going to edit it. So thanks for watching, everybody. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Boop.